the Missouri National Guard one-on-one. -on -one. Missouri National Guard, always ready, always there. All right, he just went out there in his first career start and led an attack that racked up 500 yards of total offense against Florida. It's Maddie Mock, and uh, Maddie, you're, you're back again uh, here this week to take on South Carolina and, and kind of what is the next step uh, you feel like for you and, and this offense as you continue to try to keep the march towards undefeated going? Uh, I think the biggest thing for us is just to come into practice again this week, kind of the same way as last week, but uh, just better, more crisp and not have any mistakes and just and just know what we're going to do every play and try to try to execute that the at 100 percent every play throughout the week so we come out on Saturday and do it in the game. You know coach Pinkle told you guys after the game and I'm sure you've heard it from the coaching staff and your teammates about not letting all of these great things that have happened like being ranked fifth in the country or SEC awards and all that kind of stuff influence you this week but uh, it seems to me this team is is pretty well equipped to handle that do you feel like uh, the guys are already kind of blocking that stuff out of the way and just jumping back into the grind uh yes uh they they talked about uh back when they beat oklahoma and then how how that kind of affected them there which uh they've, they've kind of been preaching that to us and uh, i mean you can tell the mentality everybody um yeah we're fifth in the country but that doesn't mean anything we got to be one to know this week so um I'm, I'm, I think everybody has it 100% out, um, but I mean, we're going to come out tomorrow like we're whether we're first or we're last. It doesn't matter. We're going to do the same thing we've been doing, and that's play Missouri football. At the same time, anyone who watched the game knows it was a, a great debut for you against Florida, and how much confidence did that give you uh, having that first career start under your belt and a pretty darn good one at that? Uh, it felt great, um, especially not to come out and run the ball, but to kind of surprise them there and throw the ball deep two times in a row. And I mean, we went down to 22 seconds, and um, just for my confidence, uh, it boosted, it, it skyrocketed. And uh, I mean, there's no stress. I wasn't nervous. It felt good. And uh, I mean, I mean, obviously, you've seen throughout the game. I mean, we kept doing it. We just, we just got to finish on, fin like, work on finishing there. You, you guys started fast in, as an offense, as you mentioned, that uh, two-play, 22-second drive to get on the board, and that was a a memorial stadium that was cranked up from, from the beginning. And, and how much does it help you guys whenever that crowd gets there early and, and, and right from kick, they're into the game and, and they've got the zoo rocking? Uh, I mean, it, it boosts our our hype level, everything up to the max. And I mean, earlier in the season, we saw the Toledo game, we'd come out there, we were warming up and the, there was barely anybody there. And then you come out now, you're coming out there warm up and it's already over halfway full. And then when you come out of the locker room, it's packed and it's, it's swaying, it's going back and forth. Um, I mean, it just it gets you those chills and like your adrenaline's just going and you're ready to play. So, I mean, they did great this week and um, I mean, hopefully we can continue to do that throughout the year. All right, as you get ready for South Carolina this week, this is life in the SEC, another big game, another tough opponent, another great defense will be at the zoo this week. What are some of the keys for you and the offense this week as you prepare for South Carolina? Um, like you said, um, I mean, it's another SEC defense. It's, a, it's obviously they're going to be good, but the key for us is, uh, like we just talked about, block everything out, um, come out and have a, a, a clean week in practice, and uh, just execute the way we have been, and um, I think we'll be fine on both sides of the ball. All right, we appreciate it, Maddie. Good luck this week. Thank you. Matty Mock, he'll make his second career start. We hope it goes as well as the first one did when the Tigers take on South Carolina this Saturday, 6 p.m. at Furrow Field.